That's the way how to simplify complex numbers. So, in your graphing calculator, the first thing you want to do is make sure you know where to locate your imaginary value. So, here is the I, and since it's in blue, you have to press second and the decimal button. But the first thing we want to do is to make sure that our calculator is in the correct mode. So if we go to our mode button, here you have different settings for your calculator. And this is the one we're looking for. The real, or you can change your calculator to be in complex mode. And this is arrow key to go to the right and press in. Then, in order to exit out of this screen, we need to press quit. So when you're going to use quit, once again, it's in blue. So you press second in the mode button. So now what we want to do is to enter in our first example. We have parentheses, two plus three. And once again, in order to access the I, press the second button, and then our decimal. So once we've entered in our expression, we press enter, it calculates 6 minus 2 out for us. So we just combine the real parts, 4 plus 2 gave us 6, and combine the measurement parts, 3i plus a negative 5i gives us negative 2i. So now what we're going to do is to subtract these two. And a simple way, rather than typing the whole line over, is to press second and enter. And that will repeat the entire previous line that you have. So we're going to go back, and we're just going to change this to minus. So negative 2 plus 8i, real parts 2 minus 4, gives negative 2, 3i minus 5i, your minus and your negative together is a positive. Now we want to multiply our complex numbers. Once again, second and enter, so keep in mind. We're going to change the multiplication. So our first, 2 times 4 gives us 8. Our outer, we have a negative 10i. Our inner, we have a positive 12i. So negative 10 plus 12 gives us our 2i. Our last is 3i times a negative 5i, which gives us a negative 15i squared. And you have to remember that i squared is equal to negative 1. So we had negative 15 i squared. i squared is negative 1. So negative 1 times a negative 15 gives us a positive 15. So positive 15 plus your first of 8. This is how we end up with our two here. Now we want to divide. Same thing. We press second and enter. <coughs> Change that to division. Now you end up with very long decimals. So what we're going to do is go to math and fraction. And this will change any decimal value to its fraction equivalent. Press enter. We have negative 7 over 41 plus 22 over 41 i. And the last part. Negative 5 plus 12 i. So this is how you simplify complex expressions.